will be at his penthouse, half drunk probably. Use this. A chainsaw. How 1980s. The Vice City game rolls around in 80s like it is unbelievable. The cocaine cowboy era of Miami. Oh yeah, lots of fun. In this mission, Treacherous Swine, Tommy has to do a favor for the colonel and take down one of his men. Now I'm going to be talking over the conversation of Tommy and the colonel because, well, copyright. There's background music that I can't drop out. But it is a good mission, a fun mission. And let's get on with Treacherous Swine. This is unfortunately where you have to listen to me talk. I could just leave the sound off and let you read because there is a really nice song playing in the background, and because of copyright, potential infringement, I can't let it go through. I already did this video once and got knocked for it. It wasn't even visible, so I'm redoing it on this playthrough so that you can see the full video. And yes, Tommy has to use a chainsaw to take down the bad guy, Mr. Gonzalez. Yeah, I heard this porn was unsatisfying. I'm gonna shut that big mouth of yours. Uh. He's got a blade! Stop running, you fat slime ball! <laughs> Away from me, you cheap bastard! Oh, sweet Jesus! I've wasted my life and my look! Stand still and I'll make it quick! You're squealing. No one cares, Pat, so... Tommy can run a lot faster without a weapon in his hands. And what's really convenient is even though the cops are going to be after Tommy, if he jumps on, there is a police bribe right behind and he can drop the... Wanted star level to one, and if he gets away from the police quickly enough, and the wanted star drops off, he achieves the successful mission. I'm so freaking pissed. And there you go, success. If you found this video informative, hit the thumbs up button. Feel free to leave some comments. If you like this type of video, hit the subscribe button and bell icon. I post five video game related videos a week, Monday through Friday, plus some shorts and specials, and you don't want to miss out. As always, I'm Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing, and most of all, thanks for stopping by.